So I've had a number of queries regarding the differences between blood testing and skin testing in the diagnosis of allergies. So they both test for the same thing, which is the probability of a reaction in context of the history we've taken from you. Skin testing looks at the reactivity of the IgE molecule, whereas blood testing looks at the level of IgE in your blood. Skin testing can be done on the same day as a consultation, gives immediate results, and therefore we can make a management plan there and then. Skin testing is also less likely to throw up a false positive result in the context of significant eczema. And a negative skin test is really, really accurate in terms of excluding an allergy. The only time we can't really do a skin test is if we haven't got the skin test to the food available, or if there's such significant eczema that we can't find an area of skin that we can perform the test on. Or if you've taken an antihistamine 48 hours prior to the appointment, which will affect the result. Blood testing obviously takes a lot longer to come back and in the context of significant eczema can throw up a number of false positive results, which may mean that you start excluding a food unnecessarily. It is for this reason that panels of specific IgEs, particularly in children with eczema, are not recommended. Therefore, the skin test and the specific IgE blood test give you the same information, but depending on the history you give us, the availability of the allergen we're interested in and the level of eczema will make us decide which one to go for.